Hey Nebriites, uh, this is Andy. I just wanted to uh, take a moment and quick film a unboxing video. Uh, this is for our July sponsor. You can see I cheated a little bit. It's already open here. Um, simply because they shipped it to us so far ahead of time I didn't realize what it was. So I opened it up. I haven't really gone through it yet. So this is our July sponsor. Uh, Zebra art pens and they sent us a bunch of stuff to give away at our life drawing events and our monthly drawing challenge and also to go into our prize package once once we hit 1500 followers on Facebook so we're just gonna go through it now and take a look to see what they gave us so, looks like it's loaded full of stuff here and um, a whole bunch of different stuff so first thing we got here is uh, well, these, these are retractable gel pens. Um, looks like they're all 0.7 as far as their size and come in varied colors. So that's kind of neat. I'll set that aside. And we also have, this is their, what is this? Vibrant Color Precise Writing and Drawing Fine Liners. It's a 12 pack. It's a bunch of different colors. Uh, so it's a fine line 0.8 millimeter marker. Um, pretty cool pack. So that'll probably be one of the prizes at the life drawing event. This is a seven fountain pen set. Uh, no cartridges needed. You can see it there. And it's 0.6 millimeter. And again, um, I believe it comes in multiple. Yep, yeah, assorted colors. It says right here. I wasn't sure if it just the pen was color or if a different ink color. But it looks like it's all different ink colors. And you can see right here. I'll try to get it. No glare on it there. You can even keep it in the uh, container and set it up on your desk so you can kind of keep them organized. And then we have, what's next? We have a set of 12 colored pencils, um, varying colors, and it looks like they are mechanical colored pencils, or retractable, let's see. Refillable, no, no sharpening needed. Um, so that's kind of cool, I've never seen a colored pencil quite like that. So you can see it right there. Oops, right there. That uh, the tip is a different color. Or the same color, I should say. And then we have, um, so this is their technical pens. These are multiple sizes from 0.1 millimeter to 0.3, oops, I'm sorry, to 0.8 millimeter. So it's kind of like a, a you know, a lining set, uh, good for inkers. They've also given us, this looks like it might be the same thing. Um, uh, yep, technical pens. Yep, this just looks like a smaller set um, from 0.1 to 0.5 millimeter. Same type of thing as this one. This is just obviously half the size. And then we also have, let's see, uh, graphics technical pencil. Um, so mechanical pencil, looks like 0.9 millimeter. Um, these are my favorite things to draw in. So uh, I'll have to see if I can borrow that when the person uh, chooses that as their prize for the the um, our figure drawing event. Uh, this is a tech two-way technical pencil. Shake or click advance. Oh, so you must be able to. So you should shake it and. Let's see, features a shake and click lead extension function. So you must be able to just shake it and extend the lead that way. I can't, it looks like it's all the way extended out as of right now. I don't know if you guys can see it right there. Um, so I can't really test it out. Um, but it's actually, it's pretty heavy. So there's some, uh, some metal parts to this. It's pretty solid uh, pencil. Might be something you guys want to check out if you like mechanical pencils. And we have a brush pen, um, a super, fi super fine tip brush pen. I've never used a brush pen that wasn't a pretty sizable one. Um, so that might be worth checking out too. So, and again, this is uh, Zebra Art Pens. You can check out their stuff online. Um, and this is another, let's see, what's the difference between these two? Oh, one's blue and one is black. No, they're both black. Maybe one's, hmm, maybe just the, the color of the pen itself is different, but they both say black. Are they different sizes? I'm just not sure if there's a difference in these two. Oh, yep, that's what it is. This one here, 
the kind of gray one is fine. This one is super fine. See what happens when you read the package? All the answers are right there for you. Then we have uh, a calligraphy pen set. Uh, three pens. Uh, looks like, again, point 0.1 through point 0.3. Kind of a chisel tip if you like to do calligraphy writing. And then we have a four-pack of fountain pens. So similar to the seven-pack we had earlier. This is four-pack. And it looks like... Looks like this one has colors. Oh, no. Looks like this one has red and green, and this one doesn't. It's going to be one other one. Red, green, and a shade of blue. So, same type of thing. It uh, doesn't have that cool case that you can set up on your desk to keep them organized, but they still look like they're pretty neat. And we have... Um, what is this? This is another brush pen, double-ended. So it gives you a couple of options. It gives you a medium and a fine point. Um, I like how they're color-coded, too, uh, as to the size, because that makes it a little easier when you go to grab the right pen. And we have another mechanical pencil, Tech 2-Way Technical Pencil, Shake or Click Advance. I wonder if this is... They all seem to be... What do just do with that? Uh, just that here. Oh, here's the other one. Um, again, they're two different colors, so I bet you that's a different in size, maybe? Uh, where's it say? Oh, right here. HB2... Nope, these are roughly the same. As far as I can tell, they're the same. Um... You know, the only thing that seems to be the difference is the color one uh, the shaft of the pencil is black and this one's blue so I'm not sure if there's any real difference in those two um, this here is another graphics technical pencil which we have that's the second one we've come across let's see if these two are the same uh, oh, these ones are different the red one is 0.5 millimeter and the kind of teal one is 0.9 so again color coded by size it's pretty handy also has like this little, it looks like this unit here is adjustable, so if you put in different types of lead, you should be able to, uh, to turn it to the correct type of lead that you have in there. And then we have oh, another one, and this one's a 0 .7, the other two. Here we go, so there's three of these. There's a 0 0.9, a 0.5, and a 0.7. So again, all color coded by the size. It's pretty cool. And of course, they're mechanical pencils, so they are refillable. I'm kind of skipping around the big things to say for the end. Get to those. And yet another one, a 0.3 millimeter technical pencil. This one's yellow. I'll tell you what size. Again, has that same piece in the middle that you can adjust to the type of lead you have in there. And uh, yet another brush pen. This one's a medium. So you can see it right there. Pretty cool. And this is another Tech 2 way technical pencil. And uh, 0.7 millimeter. These I think are just, these are the only ones that didn't pull up to the size by color thing. And I can't keep just throwing stuff in a pile here. So, yep, same size. So it just looks like the color of the pen is different, or pencil, I should say. And uh, still pretty neat. And again, these are definitely heavier than the other technical pencils. So, And we got here um, more retractable gel pens. Oops. Ooh. I really like to uh, draw in, in ink a lot, so I like to use kind of gel pens. Uh, these are medium points, 0.7 millimeter, and got quite a variety of colors. It's a really different looking... I, Assorted ink, yeah. So I'm wondering exactly what shade of green that is, because that's a really weird color for a pen. But um, pretty neat. And now we're gonna get to the, the larger packs that are in here. This, I'll hold that out further so you can see it. It's 24 colored pencils. Uh, it's the same ones that are uh, a click top. They're refillable, no sharpening needed. So that they're some sort of mechanical colored pencil, um, and it even has a white. You don't often see. Well, I not suppose you see white and colored pencils, but uh, pretty neat set. Um, 24, that's a sizable one. Um, so I'm not sure if this is going to go into our 
prize package for um, 1500 likes or if this is going to be the prize for our daily drawing challenge but this one will be the whatever that one doesn't go into this one will go into and this is uh, fine liner markers uh, vibrant colors 24 sorted colors 8 millimeters so these are all fine tip I'm gonna turn it that way so you can get a better look at them and there's everything from black to looks like there's some gray in there all the way down to bright yellow that's a pretty cool set so one of these is going to be our daily drawing challenge and the other is going to go into our prize package for our 1500 followers on Facebook um, I'm not sure which is which but uh, so that's that's a pretty cool setup they sent us those two and then they sent us let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine oops, ten eleven twelve 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So they sent us 20 pieces that are all going to be given away at our uh, figure drawing, which will be held the first Monday and third Wednesday at New World Tavern here in Plymouth, Massachusetts. So you can check that out and, uh, and show up. And this isn't enough, so everyone gets prize. So we'll do it kind of as a, a door prize. We'll draw a ticket and you'll get to pick from what we have and so if you're interested in going to that event you can go to inebriart.com check out the information there or it's also posted on our facebook so you can just search for inebriart on facebook and uh, make sure you listen to our podcast july and so you'll be able to hear more about zebra art pens because we'll be doing an ad there and uh, you'll be able to hear lots of interesting things from creative types of all kinds so that's the Inebriart Podcast, available wherever podcasts are available. So thanks for checking out the video. Make sure you hit like and subscribe. And stay tuned. We're going to do more of these unboxing and other things to feature our sponsors for the month. So thanks for watching.